So now I believe I'm going to hand us over to my colleague, Leif, to introduce the best juniors. Thank you, Marina. And for uh, judging to, to judge the juniors, we have uh, a visitor from Denmark. He was born into a doggy family, and he and his family continues the tradition. The family have been breeding Great Danes since 1929 with great success, but have also made up a lot of champions in Las Absos. He started his judging career in 1956 and qualified for all breeds in 1988. And he has judged at the major shows all around the world. He judged best in show at the World Show in Denmark in 2010. He was a member of the Danish Kennel Club board for more than 25 years and is an honorary member of both the Danish Kennel Club and the Great Dane Club. Today, nearly 60 years of judging experience will come in handy when choosing the best of all our lovely juniors. Welcome into the ring, Ole Stanscare from Denmark. Give him a warm welcome. And then to the, the dogs. First into the ring comes the German Shepherd, Shorthead. The German Shepherd, Shorthead. Followed by the Australian Shepherd. The next one is the Australian Catalog. We have a Bosseron. We have a Dutch Shepherd, long hair. And this is the Bouvier de Flandre. Next one is the Briard. We have a short haired, smooth collie. And uh, a rough collie. And this is the bearded collie. The old English sheepdog. And this is a Romanian Muritic Shepherd Dog. Here comes uh, a Kubaz. We have two kinds of, of shepherds in this group. We have the herders and we have the gardeners. And this is another one. The Pyrenean Shepherd Dog, long hair. And this is a Picard. And this is the Tatra Shepherd Dog. A Polish Lowland Sheepdog. The Shetland. The Shetland Sheepdog. The Pumi, Welsh Corgi, Pembroke, the Skipper Key.
this is the Thai bank dog. He's wishing you all welcome. I say hi, I come. This is the Alaskan Malamute. And the Chineco del Etna. We have a Samoyed. This is the Siberian Husky. The Swedish Elkhorn, the Yemtun. And the Norwegian Elkhorn. Great. Podenko, Ibichenko, Smooth Hound, the Ibizen Hound, the Japanese Spitz, and this is the Norwegian Buhun. A Finnish Lappen. A Swedish Lappen. And here comes the Chow Chow. Yeah, we have the Mexican hairless large. Mexican hairless, a Peruvian hairless miniature. And this is the Bazenye. The Eurasian, the Thai Ridgeback, here comes the Shiba Inu, and our special Norwegian breed, the Puffin Dog with its five toes. And this is the Swedish Valhund. The Kershund. And the Pomeranian, all part of the German Spitz group. This is the curly coated retriever. We're moving on to group eight. We have a flat coated retriever. And the golden retriever. And this is a Labrador retriever. and the Nova Scotia duck tolling retriever. This is from the water dogs, the Lagotto Romagnolo. And we have the American Cocker Spaniel. This is the Clumber Spaniel.
and the English Cocker Spaniel. A lot of lovely juniors here. I'm sure 60 years of experience is good to have when you should judge this. This is the English Springer Spaniel. The Field Spaniel. And the Sussex Spaniel. This is the Spanish water dog. And we have a bully black. The middle spits. Other colors. And this is the red. Here comes the American Akita. Yeah, yeah. This is a Laponian herder. The Finnish Spitz. The Padengo Portuguese, large. The Portuguese water dog. And the last of our competitors in this large junior group is the Farahound. <laughs> and when we've seen all these lovely dogs go through, Ulle Stanskjær has already decided before they came into the ring which six was going to be picked out. And uh, his semi-finalists are the Welsh Corgi Pembroke, the Samoyed, the Basenji, the Pomeranian, the Labrador, and the Portuguese Water Dog. Some lovely juniors there for you. And first on the table is the Pembroke Welsh Corgi. This is number 8469. There were 66 entered today. And it was Mr. Knut Sigurd Wilberg from England and Norway. That was the judge. This is the Welsh Corgi Pembroke, number 8469, and it's fully allowed now, ladies and gentlemen, to support your favorites here with huge applause. They have done a tremendous work so far. They have been the junior winners of the Eurowinch Dog Show in Lillestrøm 2015, and they really deserve our support here in the big ring. The Welsh Corgi Pembroke. And ready to be examined by Ole is the Samoyed. This is number 9734. There were eight, 83 entered, and it was Marianne Holmley from Norway who judged the breed. Okay. 
A lot of things need to be checked closely. The hair texture can be a lot of things hiding behind here. And uh, finally, the movement, which tells the judges really how the dog is composed, that the angulations, the brisket, everything fits together and gives support for their movement so that they can move on forever. And these are working dogs. This is a great working dog moving out with a great stride. And it's the Samoyed, and it's number 9734. And on the table, the Bizenji. This is number 8724. There were 49 Bizenjis all together, and the best junior, and they were judged by Lisbeth Campbell, and this is the best junior. Good. Most breeds are judged as put together in the same way. They have the same amount of bones, angulations, and everything should be the same in everyone. It's the small little details that make one breed different from the other. And this is what is important when you are an all breed judge. And when you judge all breeds, this is what you need to assess, the small details that makes this a lovely Basenji. The correct tail, the small wrinkles in the forehead, lovely stride, elegant. A lovely percentage. And this is the Pomeranian, the smallest of the German Spitzes. There were 68 entered, and it was Chan Wen Wu who judged the breed. And this is number 9689. The Pomeranian. Should look like a little ball. Must have body underneath it, all this coat. The head and the ears and eyes should be lovely. <laughs> the tail set to make them short and copy. And even with the small little feet, they should move really out there. This is the Pomeranian. So, the Labrador Retriever, one of the biggest ent entries of this show, 144 altogether, judged by the English judge David Craig, and this is number 10,762. 10,762, the Labrador Retrieve. And we have had one dog from group one. We have three dogs from group five. And this one is from group eight. The Retriever Spaniels and Water Dogs. The Labrador Retriever. Thank you, Janice. Put your hands together. Give them your support, your favorites, your support, all of them your support, really, because they deserve it. They've had a wonderful day, a long day, and juniors, they are, uh, we might start to get a bit tired. Juniors in these conditions, in these halls, okay, it's a tough event for them. But they all stand out beautifully, show like veterans and make a lovely performance.
The last semi-finalist is the Portuguese water dog. Yeah. We have the number, 11075. The Portuguese water dog. Not on the list to judge them, but I think it was Arne Foss from Norway. This is the Portuguese water dog, number 11075. Portuguese water dog with this coat around the brisket and, and, and limbs to help protect for the cold water when they go out to help the fishermen bringing in their nets. And they're still using them water tests and everything. Uli is thanking all the semi-finalists before he decides which four is going on the podium. Big round of applause for all our beautiful juniors. And who is it gonna be? Who is gonna be the junior winner of the European Jog Show 2015? Where's Corky Pembroke? The Samoyed, the Bizenji, the Pomeranian, the Labrador Retriever, or the Portuguese Water Dog. And the list is here. Now we know who it's going to be. Who is going to be placed on the podium. Number four is one of the competitors from group five. It's the Basenji. And it's number 8724. And it's uh, owned by Frina Botsevs. Naya, Grazia, and it's from Russia. Number three, also from group five, strong group, the Pomeranian, number nine, six, eight, nine, and this is owned by, this is called Crescendo Catching Fire. Owned by Svetlana Mironkova from Russia. And then we have in the second place from Group One, the Welsh Corgi Pembroke, and his number 8469. And it's called Andvol Serievich, and it's owned by Olga Shuvalova from Russia. Will there be anything else than Russians? Yes, because the three that is still left, they are not from Russia. They are all Scandinavian. And the best of them all is also from Group 5. It's the Samoa. It's number 9734, it's Chabacca's Happy Go Lucky, and it's owned by Gennaro Donato from Italy, but it is bred in Denmark. We thank the two other competitors that couldn't just make the final four, 
the Labrador Retriever and the Portuguese Water Dog. Thank you very much. Big applause also for those. And then we have the little photographer's minute before we move on to Marina. Again, I also want to thank Ole Stanskjær for making this difficult task look easy. And he found four beautiful, beautiful juniors to put on the court. Wait, 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 wait. No. We have a round. Before you leave, we want a lap of honor. When the photographers are finished, a lap of honor with our four finalists. Thank you very much. Congratulations to the Samoyed, the West Gogi Pembroke, the Pomeranian, and the Basenji. And then we're ready for the la lap of honor. OK, wait, 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 wait. The lap of honor. Mrs. A lap of honor. This is not a lap of honor. I'm sorry. Leif, I tried my best. I tried control. my best. <laughs> you tried your best. I think it's all the excitement. Uh, here they come. Okay. <laughs> there we here go. Here they come. Okay. At least we got the winner. Okay, the Samoy. Bred in Denmark, owned in Italy, from one of the famous kennels in Denmark, the Chebacas. Thank you, Leif.